All right, Kenny Smith, Total Force Holdings. Uh, this is our final one of the PDW cartridges that you're going to see out there in the world. And again, you're probably not going to see this one, but it is militarily significant right now. And that is 5.8 by 21 millimeter Chinese. The Chinese is a load this round for both their uh, QSC-92 pistols and their QCW-05 submachine guns. Uh, they're produced in that as well as 9mm, and it's not going to penetrate from all I've seen. It's not going to penetrate as well as the 5.7 or the 4.6. So the armor, eh. They offer it both a standard velocity and a subsonic version, and obviously coming from behind the Chinese wall, it's uh, there's not much out there on it, but it is absolutely something that if I were still in the Marine Corps right now, I would be very, very, very concerned with and want to know everything I could about it. Uh, just because it is a cartridge that is used by a country that the United States can peer, considers a peer or near peer adversary. So it is definitely something to take into account. So what you have is, like I said, it's, it's, it's 5.8 by 21. All right. It's actually a six millimeter bullet, six millimeter even. All right. Uh, the case length, obviously, 21 millimeters. And it's available really as a 40. The uh, only thing I can find load data on is a 46 grain armor piercing full metal jacket type bullet. Uh, and it's showing that stepping out. You know, 46 grains, 1,570 feet per second with 247 pound feet of energy or 1,700 feet per second with. Uh, 310 foot pounds. So I'd imagine since they're about the same loading, one of those is for the pistol and the other one is for the submachine gun. Uh, one thing that it has going for it compared to other calibers is it uses the same size diameter bullet as the 5.8 by 42 rifle. Why is that a big deal? Well, for individual troops on the ground, it's not. All right. Uh, but for manufacturing, it absolutely is. This is why the Russians stuck with a 762 by 25 talk for so long, uh, because it just made tooling for manufacturing so much easier uh, on, on the production facilities. Uh, according to the sources that I've seen, the Chinese tout that the 5.821 will offer a wound as large as standard 9x19 uh, ammunition. Will it? I don't know. I've, I've never actually saw a 5.8 by 21 but uh, I certainly do believe we should understand what we can about it just because, again, uh, I do come out of the U.S. military, so I do bring a military mindset with everything I do, right? So why wouldn't we understand what we can about the hardware used by a potential adversary? Because let's face it, China's getting birdie again, and that may be a thing. We